Hello everyone, it's Flying Ice Cream for the Fazo Gaming community. Today I'm going to be showing you all the cheats possible in Mountain Blade Warband. So to access the cheats, you go to the launcher. In the launcher you'll find a configure option. In the first tab there's an enable cheats check box. I want you to check the box. The first cheat I'm going to be showing you today is the money cheat. So to do this you go to your inventory and press Control X as many times as you wish to gain a uh, thousand dinars each time as you can see the dinars or money is going up in the bottom right hand corner now I'm going to go to the marketplace to show you how it, it's actually real and not just photoshopped in or whatever see the money is still there in the corner and I'm going to buy this strong Kergit bow just now just as an example to show you how yes that it is real and not hacked or faked The next one I'm going to show you is the XP cheat how to gain experience. To do this, you have to go to the character tab in the bottom of the screen right now. To increase in XP, uh, press Control X and it increases your XP or experience by a thousand each time. Or if you wish to level up immediately, press Control L to level up. When you reach level 62, you will not be able to go up to level 63, you will immediately go to level 2108, which is pretty nifty. It means you don't have to press Ctrl L for 2108 times. All the attributes, yep, they all work, they go up. Um, they, the attributes are maximum at 63, and all the skill points are maximum at 10. With the proficiencies, there is no maximum number for each individual proficiency so what you need to do is you need to be careful not to over indulge in one proficiency as you will run out of weapon points now moving on um, to the next cheat I'm going to be showing you the teleport cheat on the campaign map so on the campaign map you press control and left click it takes you to wherever you want to go this next cheat I'm going to show you is in the, one of the battle maps so you attack whoever you want to attack and then you just go on and charge the enemy so as you can see it's a clear advantage to them with 211 men and me with one so I'm gonna stand in this hill and you can see the enemy army up there to knock out the entire enemy army you press Control alt f4 as you can see right about now the, they've all fallen off their horses uh, I'm going to go and ride round now and check to see, <laughs> make sure I've knocked all of them out. The only problem with this is you need to press it one or two times occasionally if the army is extremely large, as the whole army will not be spawned in at, by the time um, you press the button the first time. Now here's the results, the battle results tab. It shows, yep, 211 men I, I got, I suppose, 210 wounded, one routed, one must have got away. And you can capture all the enemies once you get the prisoner management skill. You're also able to take the war horses and, oh, any equipment really, from the enemy's inventory, which is pretty useful, especially at the start of the game. Now I'm going to quickly show you this next cheat, it is how to find all the enemy forces or even friendly forces on the campaign map. To do this you press Control T and all the forces should appear even if they're miles outside your um, range, well your spotting range. Um, so that's quite nifty and interesting especially at the start of the game again as bullet allows you to avoid certain enemy armies which are coming your way and yeah just helps out a lot later on game especially if you're hunting down people with a and you have a large army and you're not able to find them in this next cheat I'm going to show you the health cheat it allows you to well, regain your health and your horse's health I'm going to go over and intentionally get myself injured here to show how to use the cheat so just riding towards this bunch of bandits and 
As you can see I'm taking damage now in the bottom right hand corner as well as my horse. So to successfully do this cheat you must press Control H to heal yourself as I'm about to do it now. And to heal your horse you press Control Shift H but on some people it some people's keyboards it might be Control Alt H. It just depends on some settings which I'm not quite sure of. This final cheat I'm going to show you is how to freeze time. You just press Control F11. Quite a cool cheat there to get an advantage in the battle. Well, thank you guys for watching. This has been Flying Ice Cream of the Fazo Gaming Community. Make sure you drop a like or a comment if I, f if I manage to forget something. Also, remember to subscribe to the Fazo Gaming Community as it means a lot to the community. Thank you and goodbye.